All right, so now we can use our magic tool and stick all these parts back in. Closer clutches are dead easy to build. Uh, just put the spring compressor part in, put your bolt in there, washer on the other side, and our big nut. Not me this time. Put the nuts here. Just cramp that all down. Like so. Till they're all under tension. I'll probably do. Put our plate holder on. Spins. And then we can just put all our plates in one by one. One. Two. Three. If you can remember, that's what I do with the clutches. Just clean out the bits in between. I've done it to the one that's going in here. It's, uh, as I say, it's something a lot of people say is not necessary. But I think the more oil in a clutch that you can get into a Vespa clutch the better so <clears throat> it works for me so I carry on using it and you know you don't have to do that obviously it's your own scooter you make your own choice but for the sake of using a knife and cleaning up them so we just push the top plate in level of course well it's nigh on impossible and then we all we've got is our spring and as you should know, spring covered half, and again, and just use a screwdriver. So the circlets in in these cut out. See these gloves are rubbish. So that's in there. So the rings in the cutouts, and it's being covered by. Try and spin it round so it's in the middle, basically. That's it. So the circlips in the middle and then just undo our nut on our clutch compressor. The most versatile tool in the box. And that is your Cosa clutch built or your crank pulling tool as we're going to call it now. <laughs> 